Crunch clash. Struck towards goal, he finds his way in off the post as Kevin DeBrenner. My name is Stephen McInerney, lifelong Manchester City fan and content creator. Over the last few weeks, Manchester City and Nex and Tyre have sent me on a journey around the world to meet some of the most dedicated City fans. This week, I've travelled to Seoul for one of the biggest games of the season, Man City versus Liverpool. I went straight up to get a view of the city like no other and meet Serkin, the head of the Seoul Supporters Club. Hello! Serkin, it's an absolute pleasure to meet you, mate. Nice to meet you. This view as well is absolutely amazing. It's a little bit different to Manchester, I'll be honest. I'm going to say, I'm sorry Manchester, it's a little bit prettier as well. Seoul, Seoul City! city. <laughs> So whereabouts are we now? Um, we are here is Bukchon Hanok Mall, and that is Bukchon Hanok Village. On the, this village was been before uh, Joseon Dynasty, and this is the place that people, real people, lives here. So how did you get into supporting Man City then? Seoul is the other side of the world to Manchester, but oh. what drew you to the club? Live in a tribal season. The Aguero, <laughs> and I can't. I remember the sad Aguero. Yeah, yeah, yeah yes. Sergio. Yeah, yes, Sergio. Yeah, yes. yeah, yes. It was an incredible game, and actually for me, the number sixteen is more special because it was the time that Aguero was young. So am I right in saying that you're the chair of the sole supporters club of Manchester City? Yes, yes. How did that come to happen? Actually, I was just a normal member about um, Seoul Supporters. And they sense that you were special. What does it mean for you personally to be the chair? Is it a bit of an honour? Yes, I'm so honoured to uh, work with Manchester City. Even if it is so far from Manchester, I think the mind is the same. Yeah. Who do you think is going to be really key for Man City in this game? Phil Foden. Phil Foden. Yes, he One is the own. key player of Manchester City and he is the present and the future of City. We jumped in the car and headed to the famous Guangzhou market to experience some local street food. Here, it is the thing that I want to recommend, yeah. and and it is it, yes, it's chicken. I've been waiting for chicken. Oh since yes, got here, yes. Okay, I last order. What do you like? What do you like? Ah, Manchester City, I like. Manchester is the is best. Yes, Manchester is the best. Best, best, best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, come on, yeah. Thank you, thank you. Oh, wow, look at that. I have never seen chicken like that in my life before. And uh, we have a special item of this. This is the <laughs> plastic gloves. You want to... I hand. need this. I'm a messy, okay. messy pop, I'll be honest. Mmm. That's absolutely incredible. Yeah. Genuinely, stunningly good chicken. Oh. I'm not. I'll just, I'll just go for it. I'll go okay. for it. That is, I will say, after you win. That is chicken feet. <laughs> oh. Chicken feet? Yeah, it's chicken feet. It's chewy. It's very chewy. Do it like this. Oh, okay. Do that it makes like it this. Easy that is, is I can manage the poke. Yeah. Is it really spicy? Yeah. Right. Okay. Go, go for it. Is right. it really spicy? Yeah. Spicy. Yeah. 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 That's lovely. Okay. It's really nice, that. So during COVID, obviously, there was a lot of lockdowns and people were spending a lot of time at home. It was quite a lonely experience at, at times. Yeah. What was it like having the official supporters club to chat to? Did that mean quite a lot for you to have those people to chat online and watch the Man City games with? We have our chatting room online. And while we are watching the game, we have a text message on, uh, so who is good, who is doing a great pass or good goal and we say those kind of things and we share. In England, of course, the games are a totally different time than they are here. You watch the game really late at night, don't you? What's the latest you've ever stayed up for a game? I watched the game against Atletico Madrid. Good game. Yes, it was a very good game. Yeah. The time, uh, starting time of the game was 
4 a.m. So I'm it so is, sorry. I'm uh, irresponsible yeah, no, no. somehow. That's sorry fair. that you have to do that. It's incredible yeah. dedication. Yeah, yeah. No? I had an, all of them. I'm from uh, 3.40 maybe, and uh, I, I have to sleep, and uh, again, <laughs> I'd be like, 3.50. Snooze. Uh, How do you say cheers in Korean? We say John or Gombe. Uh, John is simplest way, and Gombe is a little bit polite way, but because we are friends, we can do John. Ah, okay? so John. 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 I've never been anywhere quite like this before, a big game of football. It's really calming, isn't it? You can see these medium-sized statues, and they are something like angels. And if you see that big one, uh, he is Buddha. It's absolutely astonishing, Sirkin. I am blown away by how beautiful the architecture is, yeah. and how calming and peaceful it feels. After leaving the temple, we went off to explore the markets and have one final meal before the big game. This is soju yes. and this is beer. 30% of soju, it's about 70% of mekju. So you start it. We're here for to eat some Korean barbecue. Are you exciting? I cannot wait. It looks wonderful. Okay, I will show you. Go for it. Uh, this is ogyopsal in Korean and it is actually pork belly. Okay, let's go on. Let's throw it on. Oh, that sizzle. It's yes, wonderful. because of the smoke, we'll pull it down. <laughs> so this, uh, this is a very traditional Korean meal, then, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. It's something you have to do if you're here in yes. Seoul. Uh, uh, meat and soju is the best combination. Chili sauce and a bit of salt, is that, yeah? Yeah. It's absolutely delightful. It's 10 out of 10. It's everything you promised it would be. <laughs> it is wonderful, mate. Sirkin, I just wanted to say thank you for being a fantastic host. It's been an incredible weekend. We've seen some incredible things, had some incredible food as well. Finally though, next entire, I wanted to say a little thank you for being such a wonderful host here in Seoul. And it got you something as well. So here you go, mate. This is for you. Oh my God. <laughs> That is signed yeah. oh. by three Manchester City players. Oh, really? Oh, my God. Ilkay Gundogan. Incredible. Oh, my God. Zach Steffen. No one says that. Oh Ilkay Gundogan and uh. Bernardo Silva. Oh. <laughs> that is yours, mate. That is yours. Do I deserve? Of course you Do deserve it. Absolutely, without question. Oh, my You've God. You've been a wonderful host. Well, there you go, mate. Oh, I really like it. I really like it. <laughs> Are you going to frame that as well? Thank you. Thank you, Man City. One more very special thing as well. Hello Sirkin, um, it was really nice to see your video, thank you so much oh for, your, for your support. It's really nice to know that so far away from Manchester we have a lot of people in South Korea that, that enjoy watching us, that love us. I'm about to cry. Uh, and yeah, hopefully one day you can come to the Etihad to watch us live. Uh, but thanks a, uh, thanks a lot for your support and for everything that you guys do for us. Bye bye. Oh, mate! I'm gonna give you a hug. Come oh. here. Oh, so <laughs> thank you. No, thank you, you deserve it. Oh. Honestly, you nearly made me cry. Genuinely. Manchester City host Liverpool in a battle between the Premier League's top two sides. Excitement is really, really building here. I cannot wait to watch the game with these guys. Second, are you excited? Are you ready for the game? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. The gap between the two sides will now stands at just one point. <laughs> this one struck towards goal and finds its way in off the post. It's Kevin De Bruyne. It deflects off the defender, deflects off the post. Manchester City have taken the lead. Sends it away. Here's the follow-up over towards the back post. Brought down. And it's slid past Edison. Liverpool are back on terms. Into the mix and finds its way into the net. Makes it Manchester City 2. Liverpool 1. That was a good first half, wasn't it, mate? Yes, so good for us. I have something to give you, and it is. Uh, 
a pin and badge of the Supporters Club. So oh, I want to give you so this. Much, mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I want to give it to, to you. Oh, this is incredible. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Of me. Yeah. So, am I part of the Soul Supporters Group now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, thank you so much. Man. Thank you. Come you're, you're the man. Yeah, come on. Come come on. Yeah. Thank you. And it says, I was really there. So instead of we're not really here, I was really there. Come on, City. Come on, City. <laughs> is this your Ruben Diaz collection? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I feel like someone loves Ruben Diaz here. I love it. Yeah. Ruben Diaz, yeah. right? He's a very beautiful man to be fair. He's very beautiful. <laughs> 2-1 in front, Manchester City re-emerged for the second half of this crunch clash with Liverpool. Space here, opportunity for Liverpool to equalise and they do so, courtesy of Mane. Salah will try and get past Cancelo. Easier said than done, Joao Cancelo stands firm. City have the advantage here, running onto it is Sterling, Sterling goes for goal and Sterling scores! Check for offside. There's the run, it's going to be a VAR check. And the goal does not stand. It's game over at the Etihad, what a game it was! It remains as you were in the title chase. Our dear friend Stephen McInerney uh, is over in Seoul uh, and he has been celebrating with some of the City fans over there. Uh, Stephen, how was that for you? I still love the Casper Brentley. We're still here in Seoul for next and tyre. That was the most sensational game of football I've seen in ages. City didn't get the three points tonight, but we are still top of the league. These guys are still absolutely awesome. This was an incredible night here with next and tyre in Seoul. And I feel honoured to be here tonight. Even though I'm here in Seoul, I felt like I was back in Manchester. So thank you so much to everyone. It's been wonderful, it's been incredible.